Well, today was the third annual Angel Tree Toy Giveaway hosted by People's Choice Kitchen. And as we told you earlier this week, while some Grinches attempted to steal the goodies for under the tree, donations of course, the community's heart was just too strong. This is amazing. It's amazing the overflow of gifts from my community. The amount of actual kids and parents that came out is truly amazing. It's humbling. Donning the title of Vanna Claus, Evangelist Stanley, the woman behind People's Choice Kitchen, spent the Saturday before Christmas giving toys to children in need for her annual Angel Tree event. This community here is very challenged right now as far as with uh, poverty. Uh, they live paycheck to paycheck. COVID also paid a part. So for us to be able to pull this great angel tree off, my event off again is amazing. Just seeing the kids smiling during the holidays. So many of us are going through poverty issues and things like that. So being able to give back and enjoy each other and seeing them smiling is great. The donation efforts nearly dampened this year. On Wednesday morning, the beloved community leader discovered five bags of toys had been stolen out of her truck. However, Rochester returned the love with Wegmans replacing all stolen items, helping Van in her mission to serve the more than 300 families for the holidays. It wouldn't be possible without Wegmans that stepped up and saved me, rescued me when my vehicle was vandalized and my toys were stolen. RPD, Gates Police, uh, Monroe County Sheriff's. Soccer Sam, the owner of Salvatore's, they're always there for me. And a final message to the Grinches who stole the donated gifts for kids. They did not, they did not stop anything. They just, they just had the community come together even stronger and make sure that this event was a success. And a success it was, Van emphasizing she wishes to thank each and every person who donated a toy, saying several individuals even dropping off gifts after hearing about what happened.